Here's a new book by Ute Mahler and Werner Mahler called Mona Lisa in der Vorstädte or Mona Lisa's of the Suburbs. It's a book that uh, I have been involved in to some extent uh, together with my friend Andres. Uh, I'm the publisher of this book and Andres and I also did an edit or the edit of this book. Um, it's just out and this is what it looks like. You know. This is my Ann Miller. And it starts out with the plates. So it's a, a portrait book. These are all young women that the photographers approached in five different European cities. They went to the, uh, sort of the outer skirts of the cities, the suburbs. And they were looking for young women who were not uh, superficially beautiful or beautiful like models, but rather had a certain mystique around them, just like the original Mona Lisa that Da Vinci painted. So they stopped them and asked them whether they would be available for a portrait. And when they, when they got a yes, they placed them on a, a specially constructed chair with a headrest much like the chairs that people used to make for daguerreotypes. <clears throat> and placed on that chair in front of a 4x5 camera they took the picture. In front of some usually, uh, well, intentionally nondescript uh, landscape. As you already saw, the book contains mostly portraits, but there are also some landscapes from these European cities kind of a portrait of the cities themselves. It's a body of work that I first came across, I think, in 2010, or maybe 2009, and uh, I then was able to see a large part of it earlier this year in Berlin. And I was very excited of, about this work. I think it's uh, rather spectacular, and of course it's, a, it's an honor to be involved in in a book of work that you love this much, this closely. So Utan and Werner Mahler are a married couple. This is their first project together. They're now working on a, on a different project together. They uh, have an interesting dynamic between the two of them. Very different personalities, but it, everything came together really well in this, in this body of work. I'm trying to remember what cities they uh, shot in. I'm, I'm pretty certain they shot in Berlin and Liverpool. Uh, I also think they shot in Reykjavik in Iceland, in Minsk, and then there was another city. Oh, I think, think somewhere in Italy. I forgot. I forgot where. So it's five different cities, and I can maybe tell where things are a little bit from what people look like in the backgrounds. Maybe not doesn't really matter that much. It's really not about the cities. It's more about these young women. I think when they were shooting in, in Iceland, they uh, found some models in some school somewhere. So they asked them whether they could take their pictures and then they uh, took the, the young women with them in their car to wherever they wanted to shoot. And the, the girls basically calling their parents saying, oh, we're going to be a little late for, for school. I mean, this is something you could clearly not do in the U.S. where you would probably have a SWAT team 
uh, come in to rescue the, the subjects from the photographers. But that's, of course, a, a, an issue and a topic for a different day in a different context. So you see the portraits are all very striking. This is the final image, I believe. There's an essay in the book in uh, German and in, in English. And that's it. This is the... Uh, Table of contents, these are the locations, so Reykjavik, Liverpool, Minsk, I was right, uh, Florence. This is a Mayan Müller production, just out, and you can buy it online on our website. Ute and Werner Mahler, Mona Lisa's of the suburbs, Mona Lisa in the Vorstädte.